Team, I love me, me, me. It is now day 10 of Vlogmas, December 2017. Stay tuned. Team, I love me, me, me. Thank you so much for coming on back for day 10 of Vlogmas, December 2017. So today's question of the day was actually, um, how do you ask for a woman's number indirectly? This is for my shy guys. Now, this is actually be very befitting because I just finished reading this book. Actually, it's an audio book. So I just finished lis listening to a book and it's called, not. Let me, let me actually just read it. How about that? It's called The Non-Game, Get Everything You Want From Women Without Tricks or Games. And this is actually by Charles Jace. That's J-A-S-E. Charles Jace. All right. So I'm going to give you three of his tips that he put out there because I thought that they were actually very cute. And especially for my shy guys, if you are a shy guy, right, you don't want to necessarily come out and say, let me get your number and then have to deal with the whole fear factor of rejection. You can ask her in a non-direct way. And if she is feeling you, you know, you'll still get the number without saying, hey, baby, let me have your number or something to that effect, right? So we're going to go ahead and jump right into them. So the first way that he gives to ask for someone's number is to just actually say their, their, their um, what is it? Zip code. No, their area code. So the area code, so whatever, wherever you are in the city, state, wherever you're at, you say that local um, area code. So for instance, I'm out here, the area code is 619. So you say, so you're 619, right? And then she kind of look at you and then you say, okay, go ahead, 619. And then at this point, obviously you're having your phone out and you're getting ready to type it in or you can just give it to her. You're 619, right? She's like, yeah. And then you just give her the phone so she can do it for you. So that's the first way I thought this very cute, very flirty without you again having to risk being like, I mean, why do you think that I want to give you num my number or, or something just where the person has the potential of rejecting you. All right, so let's move on. So the second way to ask her for her number indirectly is to say something to the effect of, I think I might have to call you later on. So and you kind of let the conversation flow the way it is. I'm sure she's probably going to laugh a little bit because that's not the exact way that you ask somebody for their number, right? So I think I just might have to call you later. Like after you've seen that the conversation is moving along swimmingly, you two, you two are actually enjoying the conversation with each other. Again, that's another way to ask for her number indirectly. The third and final way that I also think is very cute for you to ask for a woman's number by being flirtatious is to say, I had a great time and conversation with you. I think we should stay in touch. So your number is, so again, that one you did kind of ask her for her number, right? But you still gave all of the precursor to it. You said that you enjoyed her time, you enjoyed the conversation, let's keep in touch. And then, so you're giving her an option, obviously, to say yes or no. But if she enjoyed the conversation, more than likely you will get the number. If you guys are interested in the book, I will put the audio information down in the description box below because I really enjoyed listening to this book. I know that there is a paperback version of this book as well, but y'all know I got an infant and I don't have time to sit down and physically turn pages. So with that being said, I am going to end this video right here. I'm so glad that you guys stuck around to hear day number 10 of Vlogmas 2017. Of course, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And of course, hit that red subscribe button or the icon with my lovely face so you can subscribe and be up to date with all of the tips and tools and information that I'm giving you guys in order to have happy, healthy, romantic relationships because here... Right, We're trying to increase the marriage rate while simultaneously decreasing that divorce rate. I love you guys and I will see you tomorrow.